So very quick update here on net gas, coal and crude oil starting with net gas. So without wasting any time, let's quickly jump on to our analysis with net gas. So what do we have here? So as mentioned in my last video, I've clearly said that we can expect a push down and we can have one red candle and then we might have a green candle to take over long trade and we have an exact situation I was talking about. So let's see what I've said in my last video. Now at this point, it is a very likely chance that we can have a good bounce out of 50 EMA because the market is trending up and when we have a trending market, these two EMAs plays a really important part to push the market up and keep pushing it higher. Now I will be looking for other entry we might get red and green candle here again a price action something like this if that happens we have a very good chance that the price will shoot up again we can have one red candle that can close below 50 ema so don't get alarmed there if that happens wait for the next four hour candle that might close above 50 ema awesome so as you can see as the market was trending and like i said the price action normally bounce up from 50 EMA and that exactly what happened is and this is what it looks like I'm expecting 180R target from here and 180R from here is right here 7.283 and I normally use two targets for net gas as you can see we have two targets target one and target two I've already sent these targets to my member earlier so let's see how this trade goes if the price completely break and close below 50 EMA with two red candles then we have a chance that price will continue to fall hit stop loss and then hit the next level of support so i'll keep you guys updated with the moves at this point i'm expecting price to push up and if we have a break and close above 20 ema then we have a very likely chances that price will continue to push up with the trend let's check gold we had a massive fall out of gold and as you can see the gold is now pushing down we broke below 50 EMA. Once we have this candle closed, then we have a likely chance that gold will likely to push down, continue with trend and hit the support area, which is 1728 goes down to 1716. So at this point, I won't be buying gold. We already have our take profit hit as mentioned in my last video with this engulfing candle we had a nice ten dollar moves and the atr of this candle was seven dollar as mentioned in my last video we had a buy signal here and as you can see the target hit our take profit and falls back down now this is a zone the support zone i'll be looking to enter my buy trade but at this point i'll be only looking for few candle pullback hit of 50 and 20 ema with engulfer i will only look for sell trade until the price hit this area let's check crude oil okay right here crude oil is now making new lows as you can see and still below all the emas at this point we can still expect a push up to 50 ema and we might see another engulfer here and price can likely to continue to push down with the trend until the price hit this next level of support which is 69.64 goes down to 66.28 this is the zone from where i want to look for my buy reason with one of the entry reason as in golfers or double bottom trade i won't be buying crude oil until the price completely break above 50 ema so that is it for commodities guys any question you can always buzz me on instagram i'll get back to asap hope you trade green rest of the week see you guys in the next video till then take care